What is up, you guys? Welcome back or welcome to a new video if you guys haven't seen me. My name's Matthew. I got out early this morning. I went straight north. I'll show you the list of the orders I did. I did three batches. Started with a Sprouts order. That was actually not very easy. It was kind of a grip. It was like 65 items. After that, I ended up getting a 22 Ralphs, which was super easy or 23, something like that. And then I picked up a 52 Ralphs. So right now I am looking for some parking at Costco. I was over at the Carl's Jr. parking lot because I have pretty decent service over there, but for some reason in this parking lot, I don't. So I didn't really see a list this morning. I did see three batches and the 50 that I picked up right here, I'll show you guys on the screen. It's really a pretty good order. This order right here is going to put me over $180, probably around 11 o'clock. I believe I've had at least one of these customers, maybe both of them. So yeah, we're off to a very good start. I wanna be over $200 by noon. I believe that's gonna happen. Volume seems pretty good this morning. The week has been pretty bad, but I think today is going to be a very good day. I hope you guys are having a great week so far. I can't believe it's already October. This year seems like it's flying by. So I have no boxes. I'm gonna grab some boxes when I get inside and then head to the back and work my way around the store, try to run through this quickly. It drops me near a bunch of good stores, so I'm happy about that. All right, so I'm gonna head up, grab a flat, and get this order going. Okay, we finally picked up a batch. It was literally an hour and 40 something minutes since I had delivered that Costco batch. I have another theory that when you're up on the day, sometimes they just like to cut you off. I saw a few trash orders when I uh, dropped off and then there was like a 20 minute period where I didn't see anything. Moved around a little bit and picked up this nice little 45 Stater Brothers. Should be easy. It is a double, but it's only three miles, so nice and quick. All right, let's get this going. We're gonna be over 220 something after I get this dropped off. Let's go find another batch.
All right, we just dropped off the second customer in uh, Oceanside, I think. Yeah, we're like between Carlsbad and Oceanside right now. So I got a 66 and then I got a 27 add-on. The first lady added a few items and the order ended up being exactly $100. So that was a huge boost on today. That sent me a 328 and now it's just almost four o'clock. I'm gonna head straight back down, see if Lazy Acres can toss me one more good one. You guys, finally a really good day. I love it when there's good orders out there and everybody's eating. One of my other buddies also has been getting fed. He's working on his second triple digit of the day right now. So I just got on the freeway. I'm about 10 minutes out from Lazy Acres and I'll let you guys know as soon as I pick up my next order. All right, we picked up a nice easy 25. I couldn't pass it up. I was driving right by this Vaughn's Tamarack in Carlsbad and it just popped up. Pretty sure I've done her order before. I'm gonna run in, run through it, get me over 350 soon. Hopefully creep up on four pretty soon as well. So I'm gonna head inside and get this done. We just dropped that one off you guys she was definitely a repeat customer it's funny because i'm not this far north a lot of times but i've had a few repeat customers up here like way at the tip of carlsbad and oceanside but that one put me at 353 on the day i'm gonna make my way back to the freeway it's only 420 right now definitely plenty of day left to get some good orders and i'm not sure about you guys in your area on sundays but out here it can be really good from like 4 to 7 p.m so i should be at the freeway in about five minutes gonna head south a little bit and i'll let you guys know as soon as I pick up my next batch. So we just picked up this easy 21 right here at Lazy Acres. It's only like six items, you guys. I could not say no. Plus, I've had this guy before. Last time he increased my tip by like 10 bucks after I dropped it off. Should be a super easy shop and quick and probably a five minute drive to his house. All right, there we go. Just dropped that one off, super easy. Ended up being a 26, and that one put me at 379 on the day, you guys. It's five o'clock right now. I'm pulling in, probably gonna get an energy drink at Valero, and I'll let you guys know as soon as I pick up my next one. I'll probably go back to Lazy and see if she's got another slice for me to grab. Okay, we waited a while, like over an hour again, and uh, we picked up this nice 47 though. I'm gonna run through this. It'll put me around 427 on the day. I'm gonna use the boxes instead of bags on this order. Okay, that was a little bit of a workout. We had some stairs on that. As you guys saw though, I put everything in banana boxes. It was way easier than a bunch of bags. Probably would have been like three or four trips if I just had bags, but it only took me two trips with the boxes. So I'm at 426. It's just after 730. There is still time for at least a 50 or something like that, but I'm not gonna wait around for it. Instacart has slowed me down a couple times today already. And since it's already like almost 740, I'm gonna do my best to just take whatever is easy and runnable because 500 is definitely still in the picture. I just don't wanna be out till like 11. So I don't know where I'm gonna go right now. I need some volume or at least a store that's gonna put out orders. So I'll let you guys know as soon as I pick up my next batch. Okay, Jordan, what's up? Say what's up. What's up? All right, this is Jordan. Right now, uh, he doesn't have this batch and I'll show you guys on the screen right now. It's 8.32. I've had this batch sitting for four minutes. We're at Ralph's. Makes no so cool. sense. It makes no sense why this batch wouldn't hit his screen. So clearly Instacart so doesn't show us all the same batches. Four minutes and this isn't even a good order. This it's just has happened sitting. multiple times too. So, and it's late at night. There's nobody out here. It's 8.30. I mean, it's not that late, but why? He's still not... Nothing. <laughs> 
And this also happened on a 26 double sprouts for like 10 miles. I didn't see it for like three minutes. So it's just like, what are they doing? They're just playing games. This is not even a good order. It's just sitting it's on my screen. I'll even check after and show a screenshot if it's still sitting on my screen. But yeah, I just had to bring that up because it's hilarious how they do this. It's so weird. <laughs> just think about the 50s that sit there. <laughs> and people are like, oh, I can't do that. And you're like sitting in the parking lot. Where Dude. is it? It's so annoying. <laughs> Anyways, just want to say that. Peace. Did you have a good day? How about you? Do you guys have good days? Good day. All right, we made it back home. I did not get anything else the rest of the evening. I ended at 426, absolutely killer day. Super grateful about today. And I talked to a lot of people that also did really well today. So I'm glad we were able to end the week strong for those of us that work today. About to make some dinner right now. I got this breakfast. It's a breakfast flatbread. It's got sausage, egg, cheese. It should be pretty fire. And I picked these up because I'm gonna add hash browns on this, so. That's how I'm gonna end my day. I hope you guys had a great day today. Whatever day this is that you're watching, I hope you guys are crushing it. If you guys have any questions for me about my day or how I go about my process and working and stuff like that, drop them down in the comment box below. I always do my best to respond to you guys and I really am grateful for the support and always the engagement from you guys. I'm gonna make this dinner, 426. Extremely grateful for today. I'll throw the numbers up on the screen right now. Hopefully you guys have a great rest of your day. Keep killing it and if you guys are struggling to make money right now on Instacart, just keep your head up because in this next three months, we got some holidays coming up and there's going to be some big money out there to be made. So I'm gonna toss the numbers up on the screen like I always do. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.